Let's go ahead and bring in Ornstein into the chat. Ornstein. Oh, boy. What do you have to say to all these beautiful people? You faggot. Oh, you faggot, huh? Oh, I don't have much to say to them, except for um, I told you a little bit about um, the Destiny debacle today. Oh, no. yeah. Fuck. Oh, I, oh, 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 I forgot about that. Yeah. Uh, I'll give you a quick rundown. Um, he found on Facebook during one of his streams that his mother was talking shit to liberals. <laughs> and then he called her up live and debated her in quotations <laughs> the same way that he debated Kate and Medicare and everyone else. And it was he great. He debated his own mom. This isn't live. actually the first time, um, to be honest. Didn't he do that one time before? Yeah, I actually looked it up a little bit earlier today, and he's done this quite a few times. I get. I guess it's really raking in the views for him. Shit. <laughs> oh, God. Mom. I, I, re I remember so, so he my debated fun his own mom, huh? Internet yeah, troll live. debates his own mom. Jesus, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Christ. In, oh, Internet fuck. blood sports featuring my own mother. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I sent a video to Ape and I time coded it for him earlier today. Oh yeah, it, let's just, let's uh, it, let's put that up. So for now, let's go ahead and just do it. Okay. Go ahead, just, yeah, in the future, just do it live. through my circle or some shit. Can you set that up real quick? Um, actually, you can do that pretty easy. Is it on my circle? No, I just put it up on the stream. The it's playing now. Video game oh, streamer. Can, this time, can we do Oh, it's Monday night. No, no, it's not. No, no, it's not. On the it's phone not. With her fucking mother. My mom says lefties are weaking, weakling, hypocritical cowards. They can dish it up, but they can't take it. Oh, what? Mom, how can you possibly think that Roseanne calling a black woman an ape is a defensible thing? I'm starting to worry for Sargon's safety. Oh, but what my bad. The video's fine. What, what does that oh, mean? Oh, there he is. Well, that means that what are you all just talking about? <laughs> We're talking about... Oh, shit. Sure. Oh, sure. Sargon. Okay, we'll so, so Sargon. Destiny. You, you know Destiny. The, the, the soy king himself, right? No, he's never had any interactions with that man. <laughs> <laughs> never. I, 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 I have a new enemy after I talk to him, yeah. Uh, so, who's your new enemy? Destiny. He's oh, Destiny's the, <laughs> <laughs> Destiny's the one who fucking struck the, uh, what was it, uh, Numia Media channel. Oh yeah, That's he correct. fucking did. What a I'm, I'm currently in the process of appealing that with Google, it's just taking fucking months. Wow. But anyway, what's, what's going on, guys? So, uh, right now we're talking about Destiny. We were talking shit about liberty. That's uh, uh, 10 minutes ago. Uh, Destiny, he, uh, uh, Ornstein reminded me of something. Destiny was on stream. His mom was apparently talking shit about liberals. So this motherfucker calls his mom on his cell phone and live debates his own mom. <laughs> Did she win? <laughs> <laughs> that, that's a good question. I don't know who won. I think no one won. <laughs> oh, shit. I think Just we saying. all won. We all won because uh, we, we, won. we love this. That's true. <laughs> Goggle, the let's... internet won, didn't they? For this like, one, like I, I want to... You know, if I had to make an argument, I would say his mother lost just for the fact that she was reminded that that was it, that was her child. <laughs> uh, <laughs> remember that there's someone in an even worse position than Destiny's mother, and that's Destiny's child. Oh, oh my father! No. Which uh, it was a band, but also, uh, yeah, I've seen that. Have you seen that clip where the kid yeah. comes in and says, "Like, um, Daddy, uh, Mom says, or why are you yelling so loud?" He and debates his own child. And debates his kid. <laughs> No, <laughs> I'll debunk you from existence, little piece of shit. <laughs> How do I explain to my daughter incest is wrong? Is it actually wrong? I don't know. This is like a, this is a crazy fucking thing. Debunking his wife's son. Oh Fuck. no! All right, and so I'm not Donald, your dad. Just do me a favor don't and let's me. not put this on the live stream. Let's put this on the um, uh, uh the sync video. Uh, but but while he's working that out. Sargon, I invited everybody to donate money to want to ask you questions. Uh, of course, it is you your can ask me questions for free, dummies. What the fuck? Yeah, are you but doing? you know, I I wanted. Don't give money. Okay, to let me let me money. start. Let me start with the money. questions. <laughs> let me start with the questions. Sargon, why won't you come on the kill stream? Sorry, who's this? This oh, is that's uh, Ralph Retort. Yes, this who's is Ethan. Who's Ralph. who's that? Oh, who's that? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean. <laughs> The, you know, the, the worst part about that, sorry, God, is I did that's the nice. exact same fucking thing. Uh, I just, I forgot. Oh, shit. That's so bad. 
Oh, well, I mean, look, I'm, I'm really well, sorry. That was cruel. No, no, that that's fine. I mean, you, you've been on the show. You've been on the show before, but you just seem to be. I mean, to yeah, use your own term, what you call Jim a coward. I mean, that's kind of what you seem. To no, be, that's not. That's not the same thing. I'm not. I don't want to get into the internet blood sport stuff. It's it's just bullshit. I mean, but you can call. But wait, you can call Jim a coward and say he should dox himself and show up to your events. Oh, he should dox himself. But how is he a coward when you won't show up and debate him? I'll explain why Jim's a coward, right? Because Jim, every time Jim goes to talk to someone, what he's doing is he's setting the terms of the debate entirely in his favor, giving the person that he's going to be talking to absolutely no leverage whatsoever on purpose. That's a cowardly thing to do. How so? because Jim does nothing but make character attacks, media. but nobody knows anything about his character. For example, I mean, you couldn't say anything about what his job is, what he does, you know, anything about his life. So he should just reveal his identity so you can use it no, against no, him. What you what do, do, no, what you should do is not talk about other people's games. personal lives, but he does constantly. So. I mean, that's kind of the gimmick, though, of his channel, right? Is Sargon, don't you talk about people's personal lives all the time yeah, yourself? Yeah, but my personal life isn't private. Hey, hey, but I got your sync video thing running. Oh, you got you got it up I, I, so we can watch him debate his mom. Yeah, give everyone the like. I think this is okay. Well, well I know you didn't can, want. Can you do that? Can you do that? After I go? Yeah, like, I was gonna say we should, we like should jump morning, asking so. Sargon stuff because otherwise we'll be here all night. Yeah, yeah that'd be true. And I, I don't need to watch Destiny get owned by his mum. <laughs> yeah, I, I can watch that. <laughs> right, I mean, right. the thing is, is that um, uh, his mom could say, "I wish you were never born." But because he's so small, she could actually say, I'll put you back up there, you little shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't know. It's just kind of curious how you used to always be defending the, you know, the theory of anonymity and the principle of anonymity. No, and I've now and now that Jim's anonymity. shitting on you, you know, your hero, the guy that's who not true, you cried and tried. Okay. That's not true. I've, that's what I've, it seems like. No, that's uh, not true. I've, I've, I've always said that I'm not really in favor of anonymity, but I'm not against it either. Oh, fucking I'll be back in a second. Oh well, I I, I had I have a retort actually about Jim. But oh well. You see, I honestly don't know if I get the beef between Jim. Uh, I, I I don't know. I, uh, I don't understand I, why yeah, anyone I, would I beef with Jim. I, that's I, just I asking for trouble. The, uh, I haven't really understood the beef between uh, Medicare and Sargon either. Um, I think it goes back to Gamergate a little bit, and I mean, I can't obviously Sargon left. For a minute, but he no. had to go get some more tea, of course. Yeah. Well, but, but my okay, so I guess I should restate it when he's here. My re my rationale though would be that, or my understanding, is that um, uh, Internet Aristocrat was really kind of the face more of Gamergate than anybody else, if yeah. there was such a thing. Yeah, he left, and he left, and kind of left the um, the ball and chain with Sargon. I mean, like here you go. Uh, you can and and I mean like that's Jim's prerogative and his ability to do whatever he fucking wants is his life. Um, but I understand why ah, that might be frustrating. Oh shit, Sargon, low T. <laughs> hmm. Oh shit. Yeah, but that's... I mean, who gives a fuck about Gamergate? Yeah. Honestly, I was there yeah, in Gamergate too. Like, what the fuck? That shit but, was four yeah. years ago. Like, I, yeah, I mean, everybody that, knows. That like, I like I like mocking everybody. I mock you all the fucking time, Aiden. So mm -hmm. people know that I'm not picking a side. But the anti-Sargon memes, some of them are. Fucking good. They really fucking. Oh, I mean, I didn't. Shit. Well, as I don't a liberalist, I've actually seen some of the anti sargon <laughs> They're fucking, the fucking, they're fucking yeah. fantastic. Oh, well, I technically made. I wouldn't call it anti sargon I just made a meme about him and V, because uh, they they seem to have a, a very special relationship. Sometimes. Yeah. By the way, V was on my show, and he said he told Sargon not to come on because he was afraid he was going to start dropping the N word, and he wasn't couldn't be trusted to come <laughs> on a show like the those. So like he, Sargon was afraid he would drop the N word. No, no, that V told him not to come on because he was afraid he would start spurging out and dropping the N word, and that <laughs> Nick, he literally yeah. said that on my show. Yeah. Oh, I was just saying how your good buddy V said uh, he told you not to come on because he was afraid you're going to start calling people white niggers and stuff again. So. Stop being a white nigger, Ralph. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, get some decorum. You know, that's all I'm saying. The fucking call you, Kip. Seriously, the, the, the British police are going to talk to you about that. Oh, you, you, got, you got a license for that word. I do have a license for that word. I, uh, I so I, I said this really quickly though. I think a little bit of the the shit with Jim. My thing about him a, a bit is that I, I my only defense. I'm not defending Jim overwhelmingly, but what I've noticed about him is that he doesn't normally go after what I would call innocent actors. He goes after people who talk about wanting to fuck kids about yeah. Like really as an example, like Kraut. Here's here's an interesting thing that I've learned. This is actually a really great time. I was going to talk about this without you here, Sargon. 
Uh, mm -hmm. We're just going to talk about the crowd part of it. But you're actually involved in a recent piece of um, a public Ooh. drama. It's, it's fairly public about crowd. So you accused JF and Medicare recently of um, uh, of being in leagues <laughs> with somebody to it's not uh, true. Like, like um, I don't know, the alt right or something to uh, come after you. But there's some weird truth about this, not coming from JF and Medicar, but coming from Coach Red Pill. Well, apparently. I'm not accusing anyone. Uh, what I what I did is post my Facebook page. Uh, I've been told that this is happening. Just letting everyone know that I don't right. give a shit. So I mean, yeah. I don't like I I didn't like some you know people several people actually came to me saying, oh, I've got evidence of X, Y, and Z, and I'm like, I don't care. Like, yeah, this is just but the, into like here's the thing. It, he, here's how deep the rabbit hole goes. Okay. So the, the latest meme about there is that um, uh, Crouton T hmm. is an alleged of, uh, rapist. He's, he's an alleged <laughs> kidnapper and a rapist. And again, this is big if true. I want to <laughs> let everybody know. His, his, uh, uh, Mr. Split Dick is an alleged rapist. Uh, because he he had like fans, um, English speaking American fans. Apparently, the allegation is they went over uh, to Germany, stayed in this town that didn't speak any English, and basically said, "If you want to leave, uh, that that's not a good crowd voice." No, uh, that, that's more but, but crowd low, effort, is low effort crowd voice, man. That was a pretty terrible crowd voice. Uh, I'm not going to do it. If you want to leave, you have to get out yourself. Uh, that's yeah. apparently what he said. So essentially, this was like kidnapping. She felt like she couldn't leave. He'd walk around naked, and you know, like uh, uh, it was like. Uh, pressured sex, so not entirely consensual. Okay. Uh, uh, and apparently what's happening now is there's a couple of accusers coming on, okay? There's a couple of accusers coming on uh, saying that Kraut and T is going to be sued or uh, prosecuted. And what's happening is Coach Red Pill, Coach Red Pill is... I got the audio from Ruin if you want me to play it. Yeah, let, yeah, let's let's uh, let's let's finish this the, this detail. Coach Red Pill is coming out there and saying to Kraut, "I'm going to call off your accusers if you switch on Sargon and tell uh, say that Sargon was a part of the doxing scheme." Wait, I didn't hear that. <laughs> Whoa, wait, what? what? So, I just so, I did not. Uh, but I yeah, want to hey, say oh, thanks for coming on, man. Yeah. Before uh, I go, I wanted to say that I hope Sargon was a good stepfather and made sure his wife's daughter wished her dad a happy Father's Day. 